Life is going to be painful and you're always going to have problems. But let's understand one thing that why does Allah give us problems? Allah gives us problems so that we can grow. Allah gives us problems so we can become more. Let me give you an example. Look at a lobster. What's a lobster? A lobster is a thin, mushy animal with a really thick outer shell. And whenever the lobster wants to grow, it goes through immense pain, so much pain, and it sheds its shell so it can grow. But that's what the lobster needs to be able to grow. Our life's like that as well. But understand that Allah gives us problems so that we grow, so we can become more. If you look at your life about five years ago, you may have had some really bad problems, which at that time, they seemed like the worst thing ever. But now you realize that you needed that to make you into the man or woman you are right now. So understand life is going to be up and life's going to be down and there's going to be ups and there's going to be down. Imagine you went to the hospital and imagine they put an ECG lead on you to get your heart trace. What would your heart trace look like? Up and down, right? The journey of life, lows and ups and lows and ups. But some people don't want those lows and ups. Imagine if your heart trace was like that, what would it be? You'd be dead, right? But most people want that dead kind of life. They don't want ups and downs and ups and downs and ups and downs. See, I've coached from startups to billionaires. And the one thing I can promise you is that everyone has low points and everyone has high points. So there's no way you can get away from the low points. But the key of life is, is how long you stay in the low points for. Two minutes of negativity causes four hours of immunosuppression. And that's scientifically proved that you can literally kill yourself by being negative. And sometimes in our lives right now, we're holding on to negative thoughts. Things which happened to us when we were kids. Things which aren't even our fault. It may have been our parents' fault or people around us. But the thing is, the more you hold on to that, the more, the more you're going to suffer. And maybe it's time we let go. Maybe it's time we flourish. Maybe it's time we flew. That understand that there is a gift in every problem. That on this scale, that growth only happens on the downslopes. You don't grow when life's going great. You only grow on the downslopes. And next time when you're in a problem, when you're going through something tough, then maybe you can take a step back and understand that maybe there's a reason. Maybe there's a reason why this is happening. And when you understand that, then the problem becomes easier. Allah has your back covered. Life doesn't happen to you, life happens for you. Trust the process. And when you understand that, then the one question you can ask yourself is, am I going through life or am I growing through life? And when you understand that, then you stop telling Allah how big your problems are, but you start telling your problems how big are lies.